Ramu gets up in the morning and starts getting ready for school. He is sleepy but manages to pick up his brush, apply paste and start brushing. He brushes quickly as he needs to rush to school. He rinses and rushes for his bath and gets ready. Ramu's mother calls him for breakfast. Ramu eats his breakfast. The food gets stuck between his teeth and he screams out loudly. Mother gives him water and tells him to rush for school as he is already late. Ramu, still in pain, picks his bag and leaves home. He meets a friend on his way. Seeing him in pain, his friend Suresh asks him what is wrong. Ramu narrates the incident. Suresh listens to Ramu patiently. Then he tells him about a dentist uncle who stays in his neighborhood. Suresh promises Ramu to take him to the dentist uncle after school. Welcome to the spoken tutorial on bridging the digital divide. Here we will talk about the ways of maintaining good oral hygiene, the primary care and consulting the dentist. On the way back from school, Suresh and Ramu meet the dentist. The dentist examines Ramu's teeth and informs him that he has a small cavity. He then tells the children about the causes of cavities. Food stuck between teeth. Not brushing teeth properly. Soft drinks which contain more percent of citric acid. The dentist then suggests measures that will help to avoid the kind of pain. Eating food rich in mineral and calcium. Brushing your teeth properly. Brushing twice a day. Rinsing your mouth after every meal. A dental visit every six months is considered good for all age groups. Visit a dentist if the teeth are uneven, crowded or jumbled. If cavities are observed in the teeth. If your teeth are sensitive to hot and cold stuff, gently brush the outer and inner side of the chewing area. Also brush the tongue to maintain good breath and to get rid of germs. Miswak is a chewing stick cut from a twig of the pilu tree. The stick needs to be chewed on. then. This chewed stick can be used as a natural brush. Remember, taking care of your teeth and visiting a dentist from time to time helps maintain oral hygiene. Thanking you for listening and stay safe. Watch the video available at the following link. It summarizes the spoken tutorial project. If you do not have good bandwidth, you can download and watch it. The spoken tutorial project team conducts workshops using spoken tutorials, give certificates to those who pass an online test. For more details, please write to contact at the rate spoken-tutorial.org. The Spoken Tutorial Project is a part of the Talk to a Teacher Project. It is supported by the National Mission on Education through ICT, MHRD Government of India. For more information on this mission, please Go on to the website http colon slash slash spoken hyphen tutorial dot org slash nmeict hyphen intro. The animation for this tutorial has been contributed by Sheetal and Arti, and this is Aditi Gokan from the Department of Educational Technology, SNDT Women's University, signing off. Thank you for joining.